This is another one shield, and we are back with yes, Wolf Among Us. I'll let you know that uh, Mr. Crane's it's been a while. Been filled up for the rest of the day, and he's coming in early. Man, we're about to talk with the magic mirror, I think, if I remember correctly. Right. Yes. It's touching. Well, looking classified as touching. Or is it dry? Oh, you mean like seeing the genie? I question. Magic lamps are pretty much just lamps after the genie's been freed. Like, if you've ever played Mario Party 4, and if you remember buying that lamp, like the magic oh, genie that automatically brought you to the star, again, and then sometimes I was like, wait, no, fuck, I don't mm -hmm. have enough coins, like, to get the star, and then I got upset at myself. It happens, like, all the time. Alright, let's just go to the mirror. I wonder what she's talking about. Okay, thank you. Look, I'm such a stalker behind this. All right. Anyway, let's go ahead. Mirror, mirror, magic mirror. I love all the references, like the fairy tale references, like so much. Hey, magic mirror. What up, I got Bobby? a question. You know the rule. I don't have time for this shit. What rule? Your impatience is callow. You're needlessly mm. cruel. But have some respect for our history and rules. <sighs> mirror, mirror. Uh, if you're able, tell me all about this fable. See, <laughs> was well. that so hard? <laughs> yeah, I'm about two seconds away from kicking a hole in you. There's no need for that. Fine. Of which fable do you wish to know? I want to know about... I don't know her name. I don't know her name. Not yet, anyway. Well, until you do, I can't help you. Dane. Let's hear about Buffkin. Show me Buffkin. Hey, put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> well, Snow? Show me Snow White. She's right there. Not much of a request. She's in this very room. Let's look at the woodsman then. Show me the woodsman. Show me Crane. Where is he? In the drunk What you stupor? see is complete. The woodsman stumbles down a street. No shit. Which street? I'm sorry, Bigby. I can only show you what can be seen. What well, sucks? Can we look at Buffkin show again? Show me Buffkin. Okay, hey, it's the same thing. Put down the bottle and get to work. <laughs> Still looking. <laughs> All right, that's it. Show me exit. Nobody right now. Very well. Please return should you wish to ask about someone else or someone new. All righty. I wanted to see Crane. All right, there goes Buffin coming on back. Oh. Well, I'm sure we'll get it all cleared up. Okay. He busted his Thank ass you. on the floor. Alright, let's go ahead and figure out this stuff about that ring that that girl had. Come on now. Oh, there we go. Um, let's look at the book of... Wait, what's this? We'll start with these. Any information on fables in our community will be somewhere in these books. Okay. Book of fables. Wait, let's start over here. Hmm. Me. <laughs> Him. Okay. The woodsman? Him. The woodsman? Yep. And his axe. Literary Riding Hood? Yeah, the two of them. <laughs> I wonder what the story was. Uh? Snow White? You're getting warmer. But that's me. <laughs> well. Yeah. Dwarves. The less said about that, the better. Yeah. Snow like them. Beauty? 
the beast. Happier days. Back in the old days. And her man, Beast. Funny. Colin and his brothers. <laughs> well, Colin and his brothers do little pigs. I've seen this before. This symbol on the man's clothes, it's the same as the rings. Could yes. be her father or husband. This has most of the emblems of the old days and usually what family they come from. If it's in here, we'll have her name. Wait, I'm gonna finish looking. I don't remember this one. Like, I know all of these, but I don't remember this anywhere. Um. I haven't seen Badger around for a while. He likes Badger? his privacy, I think. I wish Toad would like his a bit more. And Toad? Nice hat. Princess and the Frog, maybe? Ichabod Crane. <laughs> Scared shitless. What's that? Your boss. His finest moment. Hard to understand how he ended up running this place. Well, maybe it's time that changed. Yes, it is. Alright, let's look at this. Ah, great. What? I can't read any of this shit. I can help. <laughs> He's Google Translate. Yeah, thanks. We look out for each other. Don't overdo it. Buffkin, translate. Hmm, an exquisite design from the good china of Toad Hall. Mr. Toad? He probably wrote this in himself. Sounds boring. Woodsman? This looks familiar. Yes. From the Acts of the Woodsman, a druid blessing, actually. Someone blessed that thing. I only translate. <laughs> it's like someone blessed that thing. What's it say about that? It says Bricklebit in an older elvish hat. What's Bricklebit? A magic word. What's it do? It makes animals shit gold. I see. Alrighty, let's see. Whoa. What's that? It reads, Mark of the House of the Frog Prince. Not quite who I'm looking for. I see. Um. Alright. Wait, who, who is this? Like, is this Snow White? Or is that not Snow White? Like, really, who is this woman? Anyway. Oh, gosh. My little sister just came up here. She's gonna watch me play now. Hi, okay, guys. let's see. Shh, we're reading. We're in the middle of something crazy. This is the one. That's the ring, yeah. Where is this symbol from? Which family or story? That's an odd one. Family name? Alairairo? I'll go look it up. Alairairo. That means every kind of fur in German. Donkey skin. Yes. What does it say? <sighs> donkey skin girl, also known as donkey skin. <laughs> also known as... Skin. <laughs> ah, she prefers to go by the name Faith. Poetic? Buffkin, we don't need the commentary. The story of Donkey Skin. There was once a great king with a beautiful queen. The queen grew ill and had her husband promise to only marry the most beautiful girl in the kingdom. After a long search, it became clear that the only woman in the land that could match her beauty was... Oh, his daughter, Faith. Oh my gosh. She had a magic cloak made from the skin of her father's prized donkey that would hide her beauty so she could escape his kingdom. Eventually, she married a prince who could see past the magic cloak and knew her true beauty. And they lived happily ever after. I see. So she escaped the kingdom to get away from marrying her Should dad. Should I mark it, Miss Snow? Yes. Please. Yes, sir. Well, I mean, marrying your dad, that's like really, really nasty. Cinderella's and what's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. We got what we came for. Yeah. Marrying your Prince own dad. Faith. She was married to Prince Lawrence. I mean, that's more than we... Name was Faith. You didn't know that was nasty? 
Yeah. Would you marry me, your own dad? You should talk to the husband. So no, so we'll talk about this later. You think he did it? No, we'll talk about this later. Uh, we have to notify no, him. No, I don't. But we need to let him know about his wife. Yeah. Why does she look at me like that? Her eyes are also moving around and stuff. All right. Maybe the magic mirror can show me. Maybe the magic mirror can show me Prince Lawrence. Come on, homie. Mirror, mirror, blah, blah, able, blah, blah, blah about this fable. <laughs> of which fable do you wish to know? Blah, blah, blah about this fable. Well, let's see Faith's father. Show me Faith's father, the old king. Ooh, he's dead. Guess that crosses him off the suspect list. Show me Faith. Show me... Show me Faith. Through powerful magic, her whereabouts concealed. Unfortunately for you, these lips are sealed. What? I see. These lips are sealed. It's not my choice of phrasing, Mimi. It's simply the way this has to be. I see, so I can't see Faith. Alright. He's a prince, I think. Show me Prince Lawrence. Oh, God. What's he been doing? Where is this? Blood all Where's over the Do you know where Prince Lawrence lives? If he's a prince, probably relocated in the South Bronx. Yellow building, red window shutters. Red frames. Yep, that's the one. I can take us there. Yes, take us there. Alright, that's enough. Nobody right now. Anything we can use? Yeah. You were just I here. To do for now. Come on. She walked up, but she over. left. Sorry, I have to get that. Hello, Woodland's business office. Yes, I. He is. Hold on, Bigby. It's for you. Um. Okay. Hello. Bigby, it's me, Toad. You there? Um. What do you want? What do you want? Big B. Shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. Get over here, Big B, before he... Oh, wait. Hang on. Boy! Shit! Hey! What was oh, that gosh. About? Hard to say. Something going on over at Toad's place. What about Faith's husband? I don't know. I couldn't really tell. But he could be in trouble. And we should go there anyway yeah, to a pool of blood there and a knife beside him. Of course he's in trouble. His Whenever you're ready. With blood. Well, he might be dead. Well, let's go. Yes, ladies first. He's a gentleman. I am a gentleman. Did Toad say who was there? Was it the woodsman? I don't know. It's possible. Whoever it was, it didn't seem like Toad was happy to see him. Well, maybe Prince Lawrence can wait. Yeah, he didn't see him. He could use some help, too. He could. He was well, bleeding. where to first? Well, let's Baby. see. Shit. Listen, right? There's a bloke upstairs going through all the woodsman's things. You think he did it? What's her husband's name? Lawrence. Prince Lawrence. Well, all right, you guys. So we're going to stop right here. And I'll start this episode when, you know, I'm going to make my choice and stuff. So thank you guys for watching. Please like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to see more of this series. And I'll see you guys when we finally decide where to go first.